I was just editing this video and they suddenly released this poster for the next CN patch 1.7. Uh, forgive my pronunciation, El Cheban Listele, or translating that is, and the stars were shining. What we already know about this patch is that it's gonna be about music and that it's gonna be happening in Vienna. And now they revealed the characters that will be appearing in this patch, which is uh, Isolde, Kakania, Marcus, and Greta Hoffman, and possibly other characters that we already know. And that's it for this one. Uh, go to the next one. Reverse 1999 devs broadcast for version 1.7 on CN and version 1.4 on global. Let's start with CN. This one has been posted for quite a while now and it has some really good news. And this, let me use this so you can read it yourself even if it's not perfect. Uh, this one is for the anecdotes challenge which is a feature added on 1.4. And basically, it is character stories, but there is another the mode to it, which is the challenge. And it, you have to basically do a stage over and over and over again. And there's no sweep function here, but now they're adding one, so it's gonna be much easier to get all the rewards in this mode. This is for Mains Bulletin, which is another feature added on 1.4, which is basically a raid mode, which you fight bosses over and over again. And the last bosses have, have like infinite HP. And you have to just get as high up score as you can. This is basically uh, decreasing the amount of cumulative points that you have to get to get all the rewards. Because there's not like similar to the anecdotes challenge, you have to do it over and over again. And this is for the battle pass or joke packs. They are adding levels 51 to 70, and these are the rewards that you will get. They are also increasing the amount of decibels that are received by the player which is the experience that you need for the joke box. And this is wilderness searching. Basically, you can now search uh, island teams, so it's much easier to find them. And the next one, which is a new mode for Atu, which is spotlight column, is composed of two parts, gen sales office and retail. Uh, these are machine translations, so the official translations will be different or can be different. Anyways, this one, your HP of your characters will be inherited in each stages so if your character is half hp then it will be still on half hp on the next stage you can choose up to eight characters and borrow one assistant character for from a friend i'll get more into detail about that this mode gives you celebrity card packs which will be used to get more cards you can also decompose this for like points that can be used to synthesize specific cards so it's much easier to get the cards that you want now and this is the assisting function you can set up to three characters for now it will only be on the new auto mode but in the future they're planning to adding more modes that is uh, compatible with this feature level jump these are just ui optimization even if you didn't get the materials the right materials then you can still click this you still have this button to go back to the previous screen which is most likely the character uh, upgrade screen optimizations of dailies and weeklies now if you didn't claim your dailies or weeklies then it will not be lost it will be sent to you via uh, the mail and you can claim it for up to 30 days after it has been sent so please collect it before the end uh, adjustment of rewards for preview activities this one i'm not sure I think this can be like web events or something or maybe it's those uh, mini events that happens during the end of a patch that is related to the next patch. Last one, characters voice customization functions. This basically allow you to customize a specific character's voice language to your own preference. So if you want Anon Lee, for example, a lot of people want that to be on English but you want other characters to speak Japanese for some reason, you can now do that. Other than that, because the original uh, release for 1.8 will be on a holiday in China, so they are extending the version 1.7 by one week.
is basically it. And that's it for the devs broadcast for CN 1.7 and Global 1.4. And that's it for me. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Goodbye.